everyone, welcome to Let's Talk and thank you for clicking today. So we're just out of Christmas, entering a new year 2021. Well, if I have to say one word for this year, it would be unforgettable, isn't it? Well, because of the hardships of COVID-19 and many other things around the world, such as some natural disasters in different places of the world, this year will be registered in history as unforgettable. But there's always light at the end of the tunnel, isn't it? And that's the hope we have for 2021. So guess what? I don't want you to welcome 2021 with a negative mindset. So that's why I've got something interesting for you. Well, just imagine that you've got a cap in your hand, right? Well, I've actually got a cap in my hand. Here you go. So imagine you've got a cap in your hand and put it on your head and think of it as positive mindset. Well, I look kind of funny, but then, yeah, that's okay. So this is the positive mindset that you should wear for 2021 and take off the negative mindset, which is the fear of future. And now welcome 2021 with a bright smile with me, Michelle, on Let's Talk. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today I've got for you some very interesting ways to wish someone a happy new year. In this lesson, you will not just look at ways to wish family and friends, but also look at ways to wish colleagues and bosses. So stay tuned till the end, especially if you want to look at some funny and witty ways to wish new year. Thank you for joining me. Let's get started right on. All right, so let's begin with the people closest to our hearts and that is our family members. So first I'm gonna tell you a few ways to wish someone in a general situation. Now imagine that you've got your entire family on a WhatsApp group, on a Viber group and everyone's wishing happy new year. Here's wishing you all the joy of the season Happy New Year. Hmm, I like that. But that's not my favorite one. My favorite one is families are like fudge, mostly sweet with a few nuts. Happy New Year. Well, that was quite witty, I think, but I like this one the most. So you could use these two to wish your family members on one of your social groups or in person. Well, considering the dark times we've just come out of, I think we should wish our family members with some hopeful and inspiring messages. What do you think? Well, for that, I've got some nice ones. You could tell your family members, as the new year dawns, I hope it is filled with the promises of a brighter tomorrow. Happy 2021. Well, I hope that is true for you. And dawns means as the new year comes about, as it approaches right well here's another one this is slightly longer so maybe you want to make a note of this one so you could tell someone no one can go back in time to change what has happened so work on your present to make yourself a wonderful future happy new year well this is for creating a forward-looking mindset which i think we all should have as we venture into a new year well, moving on, let's talk about some more people in specific. We've already looked at some general ones. Now let's start talking about family members in particular. For example, parents. Now, I live far away from my parents and I actually miss them. Well, if you are one of those people who are living far away from your parents, you could tell them something like this. Dear mom and dad, you are a special gift for me. Even though we are miles apart, you're always in my thoughts. Well, I like that one. It makes me kind of a bit emotional. <laughs> well, let's just move on and start talking about siblings. Now to our lovely sisters, we could say my sister, my first friend and my constant support. I wish you all the blessings in the world that you deserve or maybe don't deserve. Well, that's for you to decide. But this is a wish for your lovely sister, which will definitely uplift her. Now, moving on to talk about brothers. Well, the relationship between a brother and a sister is usually that of, you know, nagging each other, arguing and those kind of things. So it's a funny relationship and a lovely relationship. So we must add a little humor here. And you could probably tell your brother, my dear awesome brother, Thank you for the fun and some embarrassing memories that we share. 
let's keep the tradition going in the upcoming year now let's talk about the elderly in our family well one very special person is our grandma is that right so what could you say to her well i would tell her dear grandma wish you a bright new year just the way you have brightened every year of my life thank you for being there and a happy new year well i'm sure she'll be pleased to listen up from you well now it's time to talk about people who are also very close to our hearts and can be termed as family and they are our friends so while well, you want your friends to know how special they are for you and how much you cherish them whether old or new they're always special isn't it so i've got a few interesting ways to wish your friends well let's look at the first one so essentially you want your friends to know that you feel the warmth and the love for them so i think something interesting to say would be knowing you has been a true masterclass for friendship during the new year i hope i can emulate your love and warmth wishing you a happy new year now if you're wondering what does the word emulate mean well it means to imitate somebody in a positive way because they inspire you and i think your friends would love to hear that they inspire you So if you're thinking of the word um you could think like sons are traditionally expected to emulate their fathers. So in the same way you can emulate your friends and learn from them and I'm sure saying this will inspire them for the next year. Don't we all have friends that we are guilty of not spending much time with? Well, I've got a friend like that who's moved abroad and I really love her. She's my childhood friend, but unfortunately I can't spend much time with her. So for a person like that I'd say mm, every year we make resolutions and we vow to keep them this year my only resolution is to spend more time with you I'm sure this is going to get her smiling and feel happy and feel the you know the importance you give to her in your life so yeah this is for those people that you can't spend much time with try and use it now a witty one is must especially for those friends who love to crack jokes and love to have some humor. Well, to such a person you could say every year we try to diet and exercise. Maybe this year our plans will actually work. Happy New Year. I like this one very much and I send this off a lot. <laughs> so try to use this with your friends as well. Now, even though not very close to us, but important people in our lives are our bosses, and we want to wish them a happy new year in a really nice way. Well, this is not an attempt to impress them, but just to give them the greetings of the season. So, my favorite one would be, "Hi, boss. I wish you a prosperous new year. May your business reach new heights this year." Well, prosperous here means successful, economically successful, where he can make good profit, good gains. Yeah, and another way to say the same thing would be with the word flourishing. So you could say, "Dear boss, I wish you a flourishing New Year." Well, this one's better because a lot of people use the word prosperous for New Year. However, you can actually use a different word, which is flourishing. Yeah, so try these with your bosses, and let's look at a few more. If you've got a new job, then you definitely want to add how grateful you are for it. So a good one for that would be, "Thank you for giving me this job. It has really helped me support my family and I will be forever grateful. Happy New Year to you." Well, there are times when we don't want to use the word boss. So what else could you call your boss? Well, that's a tricky question. Can you think about it? Mhm. Mm well, I've got an interesting word. You could tell them, "It feels nice working under my mentor i wish you a happy new year so mentor is another word for a person who is your guide so especially when you have a close relationship with your boss i'm sure they'd like to hear the word mentor which means that you feel that they guide you in different situations work and personal as well now let's look at a way to wish your colleague so if your colleague wishes you a happy new year you could in response tell them i've not met a man as committed and hard working as you are may all your dreams come true happy new year 
So here, of course, you could replace it with woman if you're talking to a female. Well, that's all for the day. I want to wish you a fantastic new year and I hope that this year will bring a lot of good memories for you. Thank you so much for joining me. I will see you again in the next video. Till then, take care and bye-bye. Have an amazing year.